In this video, we take the pipe and grom from this into this. guys welcome to another video super excited today we have our typhon on the workbench and this car has been so much fun ever since we got it from big boy toys but it's a brushed motor and the car itself is I would not say lacking in power as we were able to hit 22 miles an hour on the stock brushed system however you guys know how we do on this channel and we try to push for speed we try to push for more power and this car it's not <laughs> it just can't do it for us so what i thought about is this car is only a hundred bucks so what if we try to make it as fast and as powerful as possible while keeping the cost down as much as possible so after doing some research, this is what I came up with. What I got for it was the King Vol ESC and brushless motor. Let's go ahead and open up the package. This ESC and motor combo from King Vol is 4,500 KV with a 35 amp ESC. This has a 2.3 millimeter shaft, which is the stock shaft size so you'll be able to use the stock pinion and this motor is 24 by 45 millimeter this motor is a little bit larger than the stock motor but it should be able to fit in there and i'm hoping that the heat sink will fit over it also so i'm gonna go ahead and remove all the screws and pull out the motor motor mount look at this adorable pinion yep definitely fits on the new shaft so let's go ahead and remove this ESC also and the fans let's see let's remove every everything we don't need how is this ESC on there but imagine if the ESC was a part of the servo, it would be all one unit and there wouldn't be wires going to it. So I'm hoping that they're not all one unit. I cut these pieces off of the original motor controller right here because these pieces is what the is what the servo will connect to and get screwed down to that so then the new ESC will be mounted to the top of the servo now that we got these little pieces mounted back on we should be able to mount our servo back into our little truck After we're done with this, we're gonna do our speed test because our last speed test was 22 miles an hour. We will have to get an adjustable motor mount because I wanna be able to set my motor mesh. Right now we can't set the mesh. It just is what it is. Well, the mesh is actually pretty decent. I don't know if you guys can tell, but that mesh is actually fairly, fairly good. All right, so we can go ahead and close this up and that will lock everything in place.
here's where we're at guys we got the motor mounted we got the servo mounted without the esc which we had to cut off the tabs off of the original motor controller which is right here you can see we cut the tabs off and use them as mounts for the servo now we will mount this new king vol 35 amp esc right on top of the servo put some double-sided tape on it and we're gonna mount it right on top of the servo like that all right so now that we did that i want to find a good spot for actually let's make sure that everything closes first yes so we got this on there all right so everything closes still so we're all good there so then we need to take our little receiver and i was thinking about mounting the receiver right in the middle like that so i want to make sure that it closes with the receiver there which it does perfect so i'm going to get some double-sided tape and i'm going to put the receiver right between those two pegs so we went ahead and mounted our new king vol motor new king vol esc and a new spectrum controller so now we're gonna pop in a battery and see if this thing works this thing's not made for a triangle battery i don't know how this battery's gonna get held in but should be all right all right so All right, so let's go try to rip it. Here's the final setup, guys. We got it out here. We're about to try to do a speed run with the new brushless system that we have in this truck. Now remember, the last time we did it with the brush system, we only got it up to 22 miles an hour. So let's see what it can do on the new brushless system. All right, here we go. Yes. That exact same thing happened. No, I, I, I got it pretty good that time. That's a crazy little thing, man. That is so much fun. It is. All right, let's try it. Read 48. 48. 48. <laughs> Come on, two more miles an hour. Two more miles an hour. And also, we can maybe go in the dirt because it doesn't have the speed one tires on. All right, start. Kind of perfect fast. That was. That was a good pass. And and also it, it's and it also sounds like the brand perfect pass. I, I think that that's why. Alright, so let's see what we did. It's 47. I thought that was so, all we Yeah, that, but it I think I think we, we maxed it out. We maxed it out, I believe. Oh, do not do not put it right there. Start. Your phone. All right, here we go. I I'm gonna hold your phone. That's right. It's scary. I'll stay right here. I feel like as soon as it hits full there. speed, it goes off to one side. So I don't know. We'll see. I, I, I wish I could stay into the throttle a little bit longer before I lose control. Oh, you were so close. That was a good pass. Vehicle. That was a good pass. Perfect pass, boy. <laughs> All right, so stop, read. 49! 49. 49 is our PB. But I'll, let me try this. Uh, all right, Nikolai's gonna try, but look, 49, personal best. Right there. That was cool. Whoa! Look at the tire marks you left. <laughs> I 
<laughs> that was so that cool. That was awesome. We're jumping it. Look at this, guys. I don't even know if I can even make it up it. Come on. <laughs> that, was a, that was a terrible wreck. You yeah. gotta start off slowly. Oh. That was so cool. <laughs> was that smooth? Yes. That was smoothles. That was a good jump. It was. <laughs> if it wasn't for that pole. That 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 damn pole. I hit that pole again, but I landed it. Make sure. Ready? Yeah. That Sorry, pole. Just a second, Dad. One second. <laughs> oh, ouch. <laughs> Man, this little car hurts. Survived. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got this thing up to 49 miles an hour. Couldn't quite get it to 50, but that's okay. Uh, this car is so much more fun and it only cost us $40. The whole kit, the ESC and the motor, 40 bucks. Everything else is stock and this thing is rocking. It is it's so much faster, so much more powerful, so much more fun. Big thank you to Big Boy Toys and Hobby for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys very much. Thank you for watching Speed Boost RC and we'll see you guys in the next one.